Hey guys, so I'm back with another video and today it's going to be a tutorial on this hair. I have um, not did a wash and go actually off camera in a while and I was kind of just doing this one just to go about my regular day but I do not like to waste time and footage so I was like let me just record it and if it comes out good I'll post it and I actually love how the results came out this is kind of another one of those defined wash and goes that i don't do that often i did shingle my hair and everything like that usually if i want a defined wash and go i shingle my hair but you guys will see all of that in the video i kind of really did this as like a moisturized defined wash and go um so this is what i did all the products that i used would i will show you throughout the video as well as i will have them all listed and linked down in the description box for you guys to check out um, but if you guys want to see how I got this really nice defined wash and go then stay tuned I'm going to be starting off with freshly washed hair and I'm just taking some cold aloe vera juice and kind of using that to seal in my cuticles also to re-moisturize my hair. Next I'm going to go on with the Amelie's hair butter and I'm just applying that to my hair as my leave-in to add some moisture and lock all of that in. And I just apply a generous amount of this because I want my hair to be super moisturized before I use this wet line extreme gel, which is going to be my styler for today. And I do go through and detangle with my Demon brush after I apply the butter. I do go in with the um, Amelie's hair moisturizer if I want my hair just to be a little bit more damp, but add a little bit moisture as well. Next, I'm going to go in with the Wet Line Extreme Gel. Um, I'm going to kind of apply it to my ends first, and then I work my way, um, not work my way up, but then I go to the roots and work my way back down, and I just kind of rake it through, and just to make sure the product is evenly distributed, and then I will go in with, um, go in and shingle my hair throughout the entire part of my hair this part is very tedious but I do like the results that I do get when I shingle my hair and it lasts a little bit longer when I do this and I avoid single strand knots a lot more so this is why I shingle my hair I don't always do this honestly but if I have time I'll do it um, but you don't have to if you're not into the whole shingling thing you will still get very very pretty and soft results I have done it without shingling my hair but this particular day, I kind of wanted my hair to be pretty neat. after I applied all the product to my hair um, and I'm just going to do a quick diffusing I'm just going to diffuse my roots just so that they're you know kind of dry and I do end up sitting under my hooded dryer probably for about 20 minutes after I kind of tackle my roots but for the most part I did diffuse my hair I don't really like this attachment um, this is the diva curl um, hair dryer I don't really like this hand attachment as much as I did when I first got it I prefer like a regular diffuser so I might just go out and buy a regular you know diffuser attachment I don't really like this hand thing I got I don't I don't know what it is now I don't know if it's because my hair is longer or whatever I just don't really like the hand thing I just prefer a regular diffuser I feel like I can get to my roots better so yeah I didn't spend a lot of time doing this I just used the diffusing just to remove any of the excess water and I did sit under my hooded dryer um, for the remainder which was about 30 minutes but I sat under my hooded dryer I 
and then this is me after I'm buffing out my hair later that day and I didn't really stretch my hair too much I did stretch it a little bit um, but this is pretty much it for the final results guys I hope you guys enjoyed this video thumbs up if you want to see more hair videos and also leave me some comments below of some other types of videos that you would like to see here on my channel thank you guys so much for watching and I will see you in the next one bye guys Thank you.